Although actually he probably was sent to another dimension because in the first Monkey Island game you can meet Cobb and he is advertising Loom. As in the game. Anyways, that's another look at the swan spell. Ooh, look! For all the shit that's going on, we at least know that Thanksgiving will be great. Hmm. That's kind of disconcerting. And that's all we get to see. The beast is still hungry. Anyways, let's go out and see if we can punch Mandrill in the face. In hell. Hey, Bowman, do something. Hello? Uh-oh. Sit down, look. The, the universe is ruined. This guy looks mean. Transultimate Apostle of the Anti-Secular Conclave of Clerics. Say that ten times fast. Oh, watch this, watch. Oh! Owned! That is what you get for reviving Satan! You ass! But, I got my distaff back. Time to get to work. But there's really nothing in here, although the beast is go Oh god, there it is. Yipes. Room. And welcome to the long universe. Great grandpappy of the long hallway. This sack trick is kind of irritating because you're gonna have to go back and forth and stuff to You'll see in a minute. finally make it to our destination. It's a fountain and the swans Time for some revelations. It's Cigna! So basically Cigna made Bobbin and the Loom didn't foresee Bobbin so the elders got pissed and sent Cigna away as a swan which they then tried to do to Hetro but she became a ducky and then Cigna came back and turned the elders into swans as well and then they all flew to here and the dead guys are going to cause havoc around the world and we have to stop them
And now we have to go to those holes in the universe that we saw and repair them. So to slow down the dead ones because they apparently use those holes to travel about. We are going to start with the one right after Bishop Mandrill's Palace of Doom and then make our way left towards the fountain. I forget if I can go back through here, but I cannot. So we'll start with the Guild of Blacksmith area. And look, it's rusty. Yeah. Yeah. Evil Rusty. Oh dear. The dead ones have control over the Anvil Town place. Anyways, we did get a spell that we haven't used yet. We got it from Fleece, the Shepherd Lady. It's the healing spell. Ta-da! Yeah, it can't cure a sheep of some illness, but it can turn a skeleton into a flesh and blood human. It was only a flesh wound. <laughs> hmm. Anyways, that's all I need to do here. I actually forgot something. I don't actually need to go back here, but I do need to close the hole using a backwards opening draft. Now to head for the Guild of Shepherds. Notice, by the way, that all of the portals we have gone through are at graveyards. See? I told you. Anyways, Robin revives more dead things. And the sheep are still green. I am Yonder Boy. Saving the world from over yonder. And that's all we need to do from here. And last but not least, we will head to the Guild of Glassmakers. Makers.